Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. Somebody sent me this really cool logo. I like it. But when he reduces it in size, you can see what it does. So we'll take this logo and go ahead and reduce it in size. Let's reduce it to 50%. And what happens, the lines are still three points, but they're smaller now. So you, you don't have a background. You don't have a, anything between the text and the, and the, and the line. So we're going to back it up to 100%. Now, also in this, you've got two different color lines. So what we're going to do, and I'm going to, I might make a second video on that. I'm going to grab this. I think I've already ungrouped it. Nope, ungroup it. And we're going to just take the red line down, the black line over and down. Now, that looks like a fill, but it's actually got a three-point line. And then we'll take this one and move it over. You don't have to move them over, but it'll be a lot easier to look at it this way. We're going to go to, well, all you have to do is hit F12 in your keyboard and scale with object. Grab this. And even though it, it doesn't look like it's got an outline, hit your F12 on the keyboard and scale with object. Because when you don't scale it with object, when you reduce it, I can't remember which one I did it will gain, uh, it will stay the same. So I've already done that one. I need to do this one. F12, scale with object. Now let's put this back and over. Well, look, it's behind the page now. Um, well, that's going to that's gonna work when we put this. Because that one's, that one is behind, well, Let's go ahead and put our line in. There we go. The line is blocking the, the, the idea of the text. So what we can do now is group this together, control G, and let's reduce it by 50%. And now you can see it's perfect. The lines remain um, they're scaled. They're scaled with the object. I mean, you can reduce it or make it bigger but the line will be the same thickness, even though they're not three points anymore, but they're reduced to, let's just see what it says it is. Let's grab it, go to object, group, and ungroup. Let's click on that red line. And if you remember, it had a three point, and we did it by 50%. So now it's only a point and a half. And if we go further, it'll reduce it more. Let's control G to group it. Let's reduce this by 50%. And you can still see, no matter what size you make, it's going to reduce it. So let's grab that, go to object, group and ungroup. You get the red line, and now it is only 0.75 of a line. So I'm not going to do this in the second video because I don't have a CMY color palette. I'm going to make a CMY color palette and show you how to do that. But this would print like that. This is going to, this is the CMYK. This is probably an RGB black. So stay tuned for part two. And I hope that helped them a little bit. Thank you for watching.